Uh, my name is Lindsay Laper, and I'm the archivist in Special Collections, and I work with the University Archives. I think interacting with the students and kind of showing them this history of UMBC as a campus, really connecting their experience here to the traditions, the history of the campus, and kind of introducing them to primary source research, which is usually something new for them whenever they come in. It's also really fun just to see the different photographs and kind of how the campus has evolved. One of the collections that people have been using a lot within Special Collections more recently are our comics. Um, we've had some really great blog postings that one of our students actually wrote about the comics. And so that's been bringing more students in um, to Special Collections. This is the very first catalog for UMBC. Um, this one is dated 65-66, which was actually the year preceding the opening. We opened in 1966. And um, it just explains admissions and also a little bit about what the school, what they kind of envisioned it would become. So they put this out, they were actually still building the first few buildings, everything was still under construction. Um, so it's nice to have this because it's kind of their vision of what the campus would be when it opened. I think one thing that I'd like people to know more about is that they can contribute to the University Archives. So if you're a student leader or you're involved in student groups on campus, um, we want your stories as part of the history as well. So if you're producing um, flyers or posters or that sort of thing, please send them to me and they'll be part of the archives.